Okay, let's go again. Uh, so, that seemed promising for a while, uh, but I think h5 really was blowing the position, blowing my king safety for sure. Um, tricky game. Uh, okay, so, anyone around? For auto pairing. Oh, I think this I am that I mentioned before is, is actually playing beginnerless. If we do a observe, so all right, this is a bullet game. It's two two nine five on bullet. Gambit against 1990 be more a bit more adventurous than Vienna. I find the Queen chat line. Blimey, what about uh, an immediate undermining? No H6 cause does take. Unless he wants Queen G5. Also Queen H5 to consider. Oh, Queen G4 here. That's D5, right? Don't want to lose straight off the bat. Uh, still seems committal. So I think d4. F pawn's a bit weak. Wow. Okay. Interesting. It's a bit early in the morning when the water pairing. Um, so knight g5, just going for an attack. That's queen h5, carry on. If bishop g4, I think there's bishop f7 now. Oh, that's king e7 and my queen's trapped. That's a bit. What about just castling? Mind you, there might be rook g8 and queen h5, bishop g4, bishop f7. King moves and my queen's trapped again. Uh, one would think I've got. A lot of pressure here on the F file. Um, let's try Bishop F7 here. Queen sack. Bishop F7. Then I'm going to lose a piece off the King moves. Uh, so what about just for a moment longer, trying to keep pressure. Maybe knight c3, develop more pieces, e5, knight e4, so f6, just, just use this as a target. Okay. Or knight d, d2, or. Okay. So queen g3 now. So his king's on that g file. So maybe his position is not that bad. I haven't been able to prove anything yet. He's getting. More solid now. Okay, so knight d2 and just double up rooks, I think, on f7. Classic f7 targeting. Nothing special like knight e6, I think. Just yet. So rook f2, rook f1. Just get pressure on f7. <coughs> uh, I think there's rook g2 of knight g4. Actually, rook f1, rook g2 might be good. Then something like knight e6 threatens uh, mate on g7. Okay. I could play rook g2 straight off the bat as well, just threatening knight e6. Attacking the queen g7. Uh, so knight e6 is inviting here. I don't see too much wrong with that. Maybe he was expecting knight f7, 
But even that rook f7, the, the, the rook's pinned from the bishop. <clears throat> So that means queen g7 mate, you know, knight f7, rook f7, queen g7's mate. Okay, his queen, he's giving up his queen. Anything stronger? Let's see it. Okay, is that knight stranded or something? I'll go back here for knight e7 check to f5. I resigned here. That was, uh, yeah, King's Gambit can be dangerous. Um, I I was tempted for an immediate blunder with Queen G4, that would allow D5, so I'm just losing a piece. Uh, next temptation, thankfully, maybe I avoided, was uh, in this position, Queen H5, I think, just loses, Bishop G4, Bishop F7, King e7, and my queen is trapped, it seems, on h5. So that's good to avoid as well. Queen could just come to g3. Hope you enjoyed it. Uh, comments or questions on YouTube. Thanks very much.